Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today's video, I'm gonna share with you what we are putting in our boys' Christmas Eve boxes. Now, originally my idea was I was just gonna get them a big festive box and I was gonna put their Christmas PJs in it and give it to them on Christmas Eve. But then I saw Maureen over at Glitter and Groceries do a video that was dedicated to the Christmas Eve box. And to be honest, I kind of forgot about that idea. I remember seeing it on Pinterest a long time ago and it was kind of one of those, oh yeah, one year, you know, we might do that. And then I just kind of forgot about it. So when I saw her video, I was like, that's exactly what I want to do. So the idea behind the box, in my opinion anyway, is not meant for you to go out and spend a ton of money basically getting them a bunch of stuff that they're not going to use. I feel like everything for the Christmas Eve box is going to be stuff that you're buying anyway. But instead of giving it to them in little pieces, to put it all together and make it a fun, festive thing for them. So what I put together, I feel like is very inexpensive. And I'm just going to show, show you real quick. Connor's box, um, just that box itself, and then I'll show you each box individually. So this box I got at Hobby Lobby. You guys, look how big this is. It's super cute. It's really good quality, as you can see. It's thick, and I'm hoping that I can get several Christmases out of these boxes. I'm hoping that I can all the way throughout their entire childhood. I'm really sentimental about stuff like that. I would just love one year for them to be grown men and they have these boxes that are all, you know, worn down and it's still their Christmas Eve box. But I paid five dollars for this. I mean again, I can't even get it in the screen without just covering my face entirely. Five bucks. Um and so I got this again at Hobby Lobby. You can get these at Michaels Walmart, Target, uh, you don't even have to do a box, you can do a little gift bag if you like. But again, I feel like I can get a lot of use out of this and I just thought that these were super cute. So I got each boy their own and I'm just gonna show you each box and everything that I got them. Okay, so here are their Christmas Eve boxes. So over here, this one is Connor's, this is Jackson's, and this one is Deacon's. And so I'll just show you real quick what's in each box. So this one again is Jackson's and as you can see really thick sturdy box. I really really like these I think they're such a great value So the first thing I did was I put some tissue paper in the bottom of the box. These do have some festive interior um, You know coloring on the inside, but I just thought that it would be nice to have uh, Some tissue paper just because I don't know when you open up a gift and there's tissue paper It's just really fun and this was really cute. I got it at Target for like three bucks and I'm, I was able to use it on other Christmas gifts and then their boxes and just really made it stretch. So the first thing that's in here is some Milano cookies. I found these at the Target dollar spot for only a buck. And then I also got um, each boy a ornament. So I saw these at Target. I thought these were super cute. And this was $3. Very cute little reindeer guy. The next thing I have in here is this little elf guy. I actually got this at the Dollar Tree very cute. The boys just love little stuffed animals like this. So I thought that that was going to be really fun. And then their Christmas PJs. So I got these at Target. You guys, they have so many jammies this year. I don't know what it is. Maybe stores are just really starting to um, catch on to the fact that people love Christmas PJs. But I mean, you can get some at Target, Walmart, Carter's has some for littler guys. Um, especially Target, they have them, uh, they keep going on sale also. So I paid $12 for um, this one, for, for example, but I've seen these go down to $10. Um, maybe even cheaper. So I got them all matching jammies this year. So of course that's going to be in their box. I also got the twins, these little reindeer uh, headbands. They really seem to like this kind of thing. I got these at the Dollar Tree for only a buck. And at the very bottom, I just sprinkled some candy. So I love these little uh, gold coins. I think I got two little baggies for a dollar each and I put them in each uh, Christmas Eve box just for something fun at the very bottom. So again, you guys, this is not meant to be an expensive thing. You can put one of these boxes together really inexpensive and it has such a cute little uh, tradition that you can start with your family. So again, this is Jackson's box. Okay, now here is Deacon's. We decided to give Deacon the Santa Claus one just because Deacon has this smile that he does sometimes that is just so sweet. I'll just look over at him and he'll just be looking at me or my husband and he just has this really sweet, just uh, the smile. I don't know, there's something about it. Um, and so we decided that the Santa Claus it kind of looks like he's making the same smile, so we decided to give Deacon this box. But inside, it's basically the same thing that Jackson got, a pair of PJs, matching PJs. So again, they look like this, and they say Little Bear. Uh, the boys are in 18-month size uh, clothing right now, and the back has these fun little 
polar bears and um, snowflakes and little Christmas trees and stuff. Super cute. We all got matching jammies this year from Target. Um, they just were such a good price and I just, the idea behind us all matching is just super cute. Also got Deacon some of the same cookies, just a little Milano cookies. It says it comes with three each, again for only a buck. Got him a little Santa guy, got this at the Dollar Tree for one dollar, look how cute he is. And then some um, antlers as well, very cute. And then another um, ornament. So this one is Deacon's, and again, only three bucks from Target, super cute. And same as Jackson, he has some of this fun little um, candy at the bottom, so very cute. And tissue paper as well. So again, super inexpensive and I think they'll really like it. Now here's Connor's, and I'm gonna admit up front, he does have a few more items than the twins. He's just older and he totally gets it this year. So I just wanted to make sure that he has a really memorable experience with this kind of thing. So as you can see, <laughs> okay, so first thing, uh, it's very noticeable, I got him these lights that you saw me wearing at the beginning of this video. And I got these on Amazon, I paid six bucks for them, but you guys, they sell these at the Dollar Tree. So as soon as I saw them at the Dollar Tree, it just kind of stung a little bit because I was like, no, I just bought these on Amazon for six bucks. But um, these are a little bit nicer quality. Uh, they have a few more bulbs and the bulbs are a little bit clearer, but for a dollar, you can't complain um, getting these at the Dollar Tree instead. Especially if you have a bunch of kids to buy for, um, it would just make sense to buy them at the Dollar Tree. But this is something we can definitely reuse, um, hopefully for a few more Christmases. So I got him those. And then I got him, turn off these lights on, okay. And then I also got him a pair of slippers. I got these at Target um, for five bucks a piece. I just thought these were super cute. You can wear them on Christmas Eve and Christmas Day. And of course, I got him some uh, jammies. Oh no, did this melt? Oh no, it's just stuck to it a little bit. Uh, same jammies that the rest of us are gonna wear. So his say, Little Bear as well. I got him size eight and $14.99, but you guys, I saw these go on sale for like 10 bucks, so you can't win them all, I guess, but I got him, again, the same ones, and this is his um, his ornament for the year. So I got this off of Hot Topic for uh, their website, I mean, for, I think it was like 14 bucks, but it comes with three different ornaments, and this is actually, because we all get a new ornament every year, this is actually one I'm gonna share with him. I didn't get um, a specific ornament myself because I love Stranger Things also, and so it's just a really fun thing that Connor and I share together, um, just a fun show that we like to watch, and so I got him him the ornaments but again these also count as mine so it's kind of a joint gift and then basically the same thing as the twins I sprinkled some of these little coins at the very bottom tissue paper as well the same thing with the Milano cookies and then I also put a bag of popcorn that I just took out of the pantry nothing fancy and then um, typically the Christmas Eve boxes you put a Christmas movie in there to watch on Christmas Eve I didn't buy one just because we basically own every Christmas movie that we we enjoy so I just decided to take the Polar Express and set it aside and put it in the box and save it for Christmas Eve because Connor really likes this movie and so I thought I would make it special by saving it for Christmas Eve. Okay so the last thing in the box is this little baggie of hot cocoa. I got this at Target it was $1.25 and it also has this ribbon in case you wanted to buy a few of these and just hang them on your tree. I thought it was super cute. Um, in the future whenever the babies are bigger and they're drinking hot cocoa also I'll just buy a box of hot cocoa mix and just put a bag in each box kind of like how I did with the popcorn but since it was only him this year I just saw this saw this and I thought it was super cute so I just got that for him uh, for his box so I hope you guys enjoyed this video thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one